Hi guys, it's Ian here. So you'll never guess what, I am once again waving my wand around onto our lovely ladies of the general public. And hey, look, there was absolutely no innuendo implied by that, okay? I'm talking about this magic wand. So anyway, today's question is gonna be an interesting one. It might not appear as what it seems like at first glance, because today I'm gonna be asking the girls whether they like posh guys. But you see, you know, a lot of you might be thinking, well, that I'm basically asking them if they like rich guys. Well, not quite. It's not quite the same thing, you see, because you can have rich guys who aren't posh. Like take Alan Sugar, for instance. So what I'm really asking is in relation to, you know, how guys communicate and how attractive it is when they have a posh accent versus say, you know, more of a working class or a redneck type accent for those of you in the States. Now, I personally think it's gonna be a real mix bag. I think some girls will like the posh accent whilst some will like the poshless accent. But hey, I'm not here to speculate. So let's find out how the ladies will respond to this one. So stay tuned. Hi guys, now the question that we have for today is, do girls like posh guys? I think it really depends. No, no, no. I think it depends on how posh the person is. No. Entirely depends on the guy. I find it kind of gay. No. I think if you're a regular person, you go for the substance of someone, not their class. And I think that goes for all people, whether it's girls or guys, guys and guys, girls and guys, doesn't matter. Yeah. I think you go for the substance and forget the class. So if you're a good person, you've got some good morals, then that's good with me. Why would you say no? It's too basic and, I don't know, it's basic. Good. And it's really boring, I guess. It's boring. Yeah. <laughs> I think some girls do, but I personally don't. You wouldn't go out with a posh guy? I Personally, I wouldn't. I prefer more bad boy, rough. Like nice boy. It's all about personality and how you come across as a whole. That doesn't matter. Yeah. That's just an extra weird category that exists. I personally do not. I like a more rough and country. Depends on the man. Like you know when some of your posh is kind of like interesting and they're kind of funny. But if you're posh in an obnoxious kind of way. And arrogant. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's when I don't like it. But if you come with like sort of like a character and it's kind of like a funny funny kind of posh, it's kind of attractive, yeah. I think girls like someone who's posh, half posh, half not. Someone who can, aff like posh, because you assume someone who's posh that can afford and give you a nice, they're motivated. And but they're not so strict on that. For me, it depends on the person. It doesn't matter posh or not it's more of what's inside yeah whether they dress posh or act posh like you know I like a strong accent Cockney's fine <laughs> I mean, it depends on what the type of guy is where he comes from if he has, comes from a good background but I don't think girls just specifically go for posh guys Re really okay yeah I like the look of a posh guy it just depends on the personality if they're like really really posh and they just come out speaking quite arrogant I don't like them if they're like nice and still posh they're still nice because I, I feel like I'm a posh girl myself as well. So, okay, yeah, okay, okay. So I, don't, I don't really mind as long as they're really nice. It's not for me to judge, you know, but just yeah. the vibe of it, it's kind of like an escapist behavior to the life. I don't find it real and tough, so it's not attractive to me. I don't think so. I'm not a posh person. I probably wouldn't go for a posh person, to be honest, really? or a posh accent. For me, it's a uh, why not. Would you ever date a guy with, say, like a Cockney accent? Yeah, well, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if I like them. Can you show me your poshest accent? Oh, no, I can't. <laughs> I can't. Oh, it's really nice to talk to you tonight. I'm going to go and have a drink, but thanks for all this. and Lovely to meet you. Darling, shall we go for a cup of tea? Oh, God. I actually get told that I have one, so... <laughs> by you. Just keep speaking. So, um, <laughs> you've had that already, I'm afraid. <laughs> your tea is ready. Oh, I like that. I like that. <laughs> um, can you take a picture of me, please? Because I have to put it on Instagram. <laughs> I don't know what to say, I always get really weird. <laughs> it's like a cup of tea, love. Yeah. Like, that's yeah, how I yeah, yeah. <laughs> like my friend, she's like, oh, let's go to the ball, go to the mall. <laughs> oh, yeah, so, um, I, I don't know. It's <laughs> <laughs> <That's> good, it's <laughs> good. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm just going to go to Harrods and, you know, pick up a, a little gown. I don't know, I don't know. Darling, your tea's ready. Darling, the mince pies have just come out the oven. <laughs> 
Oh my god. <laughs> my poshest accent. So, do you mind if I talk like this? Oh, yes, darling. Of course, of course I can. Darling, your tea is ready. Oh, Schwabsha, would you like a cup of tea? Maybe some Pepsi? Okay, now that was just class. Get it? Only kidding. But no, seriously, look, that was awesome. And there was a lot of different responses from our ladies. But look, I have to throw a little bit of a disclaimer out there for those of you watching because remember these are ultimately opinions and nothing else because the sample size is simply not big enough for us to reach a definitive conclusion or a definitive answer to this question nevertheless as you saw some girls like posh guys whilst others are not too bothered because at the end of the day look it's never going to be that make or break with the girl it doesn't matter whether you're posh or whether you're not as long as you try to communicate really well with her you will just do fine so believe in yourself my friends so anyway that is all for me today but do stay tuned for many more street interviews from myself and from Annabella Rose now we all know that she has no competition also don't forget to check out our products and our services at karmalifestyles.com now today you are joined by Ian Miles and I shall see you next time.